Hi everyone and welcome to The Weight Loss Diaries. I'm Denise. I'm your Saturday vlogger. It is Saturday, September 12th, 2009. Okay, um, okay, so to report on my weight this week, I lost one pound. And, <laughs> one pound exactly, and I'm extremely proud of that one pound. <laughs> More so than any other pounds that I've lost. And the reason is because I totally went off plan this last week. I went off plan three different times, three different days and counted all my points all those days and racked up the negative because on Weight Watchers Online you can rack up negative you know it'll, it'll it'll count for you negative so then I thought okay well I might not lose weight this week <clears throat> but I'm gonna get that number back down to zero by doing activity so I stepped up increased my activity for the rest of the week and really watched my points still ate not all of my points I think I had five left over one day and maybe eight left over the very last day but again, that's because I wasn't hungry. I ate all of my, when I eat really clean and really on plan, sometimes I don't need all the points because I'm um, full. And I don't, I watch my portion control mostly. And I eat the five, five to six small meals a day. So if I've eaten my meals and it's time for bed and I'm not gonna push and get the other five points in because that seems pointless to me. That was not supposed to be a pun. <laughs> um, <laughs> So I'm really proud of that pound because I worked my butt off for it. Totally worked my butt off for it to try to just just hopefully maintain or not have too much of a gain and I actually lost a pound. So I was really thrilled with that. And I have to say that I really believe that the reason that I went off plan was because of that donut shop whole experience on that Saturday. It just left me craving food so badly. Um, and so I had a little episode with the bag of Cheetos bag and a half really not a little bag a big bag <laughs> was not pretty <laughs> um, so anyway I'm really excited about this because it makes me feel like okay I had a lapse and I regained control that I don't know if that's ever happened for me usually when I have a lapse it's months or weeks but usually months before I get back control so having this focus and drive and attention focused on on my goal and that broken down into weeks and that I really want to achieve it it matters to me I'm this is really really important to me and so I'm making it I'm making it very important it comes before everything else in my life right now so I'm really excited about that so down one pound which makes I don't know where am I I'm one what am I I'm 236.2 and that's a total of 24.6 lost. So I'm really close to 25. Um, I met my Halloween goal in already and I have 2.7 to meet my September goal. Really I've met my September goal because it was to weigh 243.5 but I weigh 236.2. So, but instead what I'm doing is every new month I just want to lose five and a half pounds. So that's the goal. So I have 2.7 left in this month to try to achieve that. So hopefully that will happen. Um, so topic of the week this week is to share a healthy recipe and I found this recipe in a magazine like a like a home and garden magazine or something and I figured out what the points were on it and I changed the ingredients a little bit to be more whole food based and it turns out that um, it's totally doable and a really great snack so they're called zucchini pancakes and since zucchini is in season right now I thought this might be a really good recipe and basically it consists of zucchini salt, eggs, garlic, wheat flour, whole wheat flour, uh, grated Parmesan cheese, finely chopped onions, ground black pepper, and you can have sour cream with it if you want, but, and I have a fat-free sour cream that I use, the kind with the cow print on it, that's a zero point for, I think it's one tablespoon or maybe it's two tablespoons, I don't know, but I'm, I'm going to have them today just plain. Um, so I'm not going to tell you how to make them, I'm just going to put the recipe in the sidebar and then you can take a look at it. So it's really easy, not hard at all. They're so good. They taste a lot worse than what the actual count is. They are, it makes 30, the recipe makes 30 pancakes and there's 62 calories, two grams of fat and one gram of fiber for two pancakes and two pancakes equals one point. So I'm having six pancakes and I'll show you what they look like. get my camera here that is a zucchini pancake so they're just tiny not real big and you cook them in a frying pan with healthy oil I use the spray olive oil and they just look like that and they're 
they're soft though. They're like a pancake. You know, they're not they're not crispy. They're soft like a pancake. Mmm, they're good too. <laughs> I'm a salty kind of girl. I like things that have onions and garlic and that kind of flavor to them. So this has that. It's really, really yummy. So anyway, that's it for me and I'll see y'all next week. Bye.